Hi, Gwen Fox here. I'm so happy that you are here because I love having you. But I have a question for you. Have you ever doubted yourself as an artist or maybe even as a person? Now, I think I'm going to jump ahead here and answer for you because I'm sure that at some time in your life that you've experienced doubt because it's that's a normal thing. But when it comes to doubting yourself as an artist, it, it affects the way you create. And it doesn't matter the medium that you're using. It affects how you approach the easel. And how you approach the easel is how you create. And the feeling, the knowing, and if there's doubt, you're not going to create very much. So letting go of doubt is essential for you to create magnificent art. You know, each year I select a word of the year. Now, I put it on my studio wall and I see it every day. And this year, I selected the word trust. Trust is a heavy word. It's loaded with all kinds of interpretations. Why did I select this word? Well, I wanted to trust the way I'm painting, to know it's my way and doesn't have to be perfect. This has been a problem for me for many years. Perhaps it's been yours as well. But I really wanted to trust myself, to create in a way that to me, it felt worthy to be able to put it out into the world for others to see. And again, I needed to know, it doesn't have to be perfect. Now you know the feeling of doubt. Doubt enters your studio like hungry 10 week old puppy. Doubt's happy to be with you today because guess what? Doubt's decided to be your studio assistant for the day. Aren't you thrilled? Doubt can cause you to quit because before you even start painting, doubt destroys your enthusiasm, smothers your inspiration. But doubt waits patiently for the perfect moment to discredit your creativity. And because of doubt's strong energy level, it doesn't take long to accomplish the goal. Doubt can be as powerful as certainty. Doubt causes fear, and you know what fear does. It just shuts you down. Doubt keeps you in the same place because doubt doesn't want you to grow. Because doubt's a little bit more secure if you stay the same. Doubt's very, very persistent. And doubt convinces you to feel inadequate. Therefore, you start thinking that you just might be a fraud. Anybody had this feeling? I certainly have. But the brilliant director, Francis Ford Coppola, said, I don't think that there is an artist of any value who doesn't doubt what they're doing. Don't you love this quote? I love it. Now, so just remember that doubt is part, it's just part of being an artist. But the important thing to remember is this, that you are the one in control, not doubt you. Now, I also wanted to let you know that I will be doing two workshop retreats at my home and studio here in Taos, New Mexico this coming September. Check out my website, gwenfox.com, to see if either one of these wonderful workshops calls your name. They're going to be fabulous, by the way. And I really need to tell you that there will be a very limited number of artists that I can take. So let me know if you're interested or if you just have questions, email me and we'll set up a time to talk. I want you to have a great week. Take care. I love you and I'll see you next week. Bye. Bye.